Now, along with the two statewide questions at the polls, Bar Harbor voters had another ordinance to consider, too. And News Center Maine Sam Rogers is live in Bar Harbor with that information. Thanks, Cindy. Voters have been filing in all day here at the town municipal building. Bar Harbor, as we all know, is known to be a popular summer destination in Maine. Those summers where homes are rented are leaving residents with some issues. The issue is not having a clear definition of vacation rentals. Some residents need to rent rooms in their homes just to make enough money to live here. Others buy and rent additional properties for additional income, taking away year-round living options for people trying to move to Bar Harbor, moving to a town centered around the summer season. I understand that people have like the right to rent out their home to vacationers, but at the same time, I think we need to figure out some sort of more sustainable uh, year-round housing situation. Yeah. How it fits in our economy, how it fits in our, for, for the people, the community, the residents, and to make sure that we do it that it's in a way that's respectful to, to, to every, everyone. With a yes vote today, the town will get to work on defining what rental property is. They also will re set the number of minimum days that people can rent out, which will likely be fewer than the standard now, which is five. With a no vote today, there will be no change to residency requirements for property owners and no change to the minimum number of days they can rent out their rooms. If a new plan is written, voters will come back here next year to pass or block any ordinances. In Bar Harbor, Sam Rogers, Lee and Cindy, back to you.